get closer now in the hands of John O'Neill, you now disputing that second position from Cool Lad. Don't be talking, begins to drop out, and he's been just passed there by Golden Investment. Admiral Bob and Where's Granny are still in touch with that main group. A mistake there by Cool Lad, an unseated rider. Cool Lad, unseated rider, went in about fifth position. Felito Bay just gets to the other side, but Bishop Maxwell is being pulled up before jumping to the fourth loss. Continuing their run down along the back straight, the next fence they meet is three from the finish. And a little bit left now, about to be joined on the outside by Old Fired Up. Golden Investment continues to get closer going into third. From Kilna Shane is in fourth. Admiral Bob, where's Granny is next? From James JD. Don't be talking, was pulled up. Rock and Sand is pulled up as well. And there, the last one's still going. Racing into the home straight, they come. And a little bit less, the yellow and black for Jamie Cod. About to be challenged now, on his inside is. All fired up, widest of all is Golden Investment, they're clear from Admiral Bob and Kilna Shane. Three spread right across the width of the fence as they race on down towards the second lap. A little bit less is gone. Bad mistake by All Fired Up. Admiral Bob also made a slight error and racing on down towards the final fence. Golden Investment driven eight lengths clear by Barry O'Neill. Jumps the final fence well and it's rare that the Bonbeck Syndicate have a debut in the older maiden. Supporters should have take heed of that as Golden Investment makes a fine winning debut for Dunica Doyle and Barry O'Neill. Second is All Fired Up after it being slightly hampered at second lap. Admiral Bob is in third, and where's Granny's in fourth? Four lengths back to Kilna Shane, who was 12 lengths clear over James JD, who is the final one to complete.